It's mystery box time. The Woo! 2022 World Cup is only a few days away. So to celebrate, we're going to be opening a World Cup mystery box. Ooh. And this time the sellers have actually put question marks on it. Yeah, the postman was a bit confused when he dropped that off. Because it's a mystery. And I also locked myself in the house when I was trying no to... No one cares. <laughs> Got him. Just a couple of things before we get into this video. A lot of people have asked what my plans are for the 2022 World Cup. I will be addressing that at the end of this video. I am also giving away a £50 voucher for you to spend on any World Cup shirt of your choice. All you have to do to have a chance of winning it is like this video and subscribe to the channel. This mystery box cost us £500, which was made possible by this video's sponsor, Displate, who right now have their biggest ever sale on. More on that later. If you weren't already aware, Displate are the world's leading metal poster website, and I absolutely love them, especially as we have a rental property. Like, they're genuinely so, so good. The posters are safe and simple to use as they use a simple magnetic mounting system which is so easy and reliable. As you can see, trying to stick my own stuff on the wall for my backdrop has gone horribly as it just fallen off the wall. However, every display I've ever ordered has stayed on the wall easily and never looks like falling off. It's safe, it's simple to use, easy to remove and it doesn't leave any marks either from my experience. Display have branded and artistic designs on their site with brands such as Rocket League, Marvel, DC, Netflix, Star Wars, which you can see we love the Star Wars one with my lovely little Revenge of the Sith poster. I will fight anyone. It is the best of the Star Wars movies other than actually Rogue One. I love Rogue One. I also got this Bielsa one, as you can see, because I still miss him very much. Anyway, as I mentioned earlier, it's currently their biggest ever sale to celebrate Black Friday, and their offer is, if you use my link in the description, you will save 35% on orders of one or two disc plates, 39% on orders of three or four, and 44% on orders of five or more disc plates. It's a fantastic offer. It's their biggest ever offer to celebrate Black Friday. So make sure to check out this plate using the link at the top of the description. They have some amazing designs on there. It, it genuinely is like a really, really rate this plate as a company. So be sure to use my link and make sure to save some money because it's their biggest ever sale. So check out this plate at the top of the description and back to the mystery box. All right, let's get into this. A huge thanks to the sellers who have provided it. They are on screen right now. They provided it very last minute and they've done it and compiled something that I've been told is going to be very good from them. So check them out. Their Twitters are in the description. A huge thanks to you. Let's get into the box. What's that? Into the box. <laughs> this is very nice what they've done. They've done us like a little, it feels like a hamper. Yeah, it's like a fabric -y box. Would you like to take the lid off? I will not look at the contents. Oh, oh, okay. Don't look. Well, like, you can look, but like, just, oh my God, I've just seen a bag of Maltesers. Hi, Edis. Enjoy the mystery box. And then it's got there things. Got a Roy of the Rovers thing. Brian Talbot plus Graham Sunas inside. Who's that? No, an old footballer. He's a bit of a YouTuber, isn't he? World Cup stickers. This is really nice. Shout out to the sellers. This is a really nice way to start. Some World Cup stickers. And some more teasers. Jodie's buzzing. Jodie is buzzing. This is very nice. So everything has its own yeah, little yeah, bag. So we, we can look. There's, there's no, we can look. There's no I'll cheating. prove it to you guys just because there seems to be quite a lot of things in here as well. This is really... This is lovely. What a way. Welcome to Miami. Miami, Miami. Do the items? No. So item one. This, I reckon, France. is a France item. Let's have a look. No. No. It well, is I didn't say France. A USA mm. little training sweat. That's very nice. Beautiful. Soft. Marketing no, no, team. The, the inside is fleece. Yeah, very fleecy. Three, two, one. It's very tight. I it suits you though. We need to get onto the next item. It's a bit tight, isn't it? Because it's very tight. Let's get onto the next item okay. before I choke to death. I need it! Why are you taking so long? <laughs> Just joking. It's yellow. I'm guessing Brazil from a first glance. Hey, I was right. Oh, hang on a minute. Let me get a coat hanger. If you can guess what name is on the back. Oh, they won't, I'm not going to know if they did it before or after I revealed it, am I? Huh? I was going to say, if you can guess what name is on the back, you win a prize, but they'll just skip forward and then comment the name. Yeah, but this is a very nice, one of the best Brazil shirts of all time, in my opinion. You can see it over there on screen, and it's also very got nice. Roberto Carlos printing on Ooh. it as well. Like, that is an unbelievable that item. That is, is very, beautiful. very good. So far, a good start to the... I'm going to have to take this off. I'm going to die. A little oh. bit of mesh at the bottom, nice and floaty. 
ready for the Qatar heat. Um, our Carlos um, started playing when he was six. Sounds like a Yorkshire's, Yorkshire woman's mum. It's our Carlos. <laughs> well, our Carlos, he's yeah. number six. Yeah. He, uh, our Carlos, he's, he's, he's lovely, ain't he? So far, so good. I've... It is not a jumper. What is it? It is a jumper. It's a Holland jumper. Oh. No, it's not. It is not one Holland shirt. I got it right, though. Two Holland shirts in one bag. This is amazing. Like, they've got the sim same template as um, the Brazil one. There's a very, um, very nice Holland shirt. I like That's the centre one, though. Yep. It's nice. It's very nice. It's a very good shirt. Both of these are really nice as well. You can see them overlaid on screen. It smells nice, too. Smell it. it. Smells like Christmas. The sellers have actually washed yeah, the items really nice. once. Usually we get a mystery box and this room stinks mm. for a while afterwards. This has been an amazing... This has been... Uh, I'm, I'm very happy with the start of this box. I'm I think very it's happy been very, very good so far. There's, there's so many items in here. We've still got seven items to go. Blimey. This I'm is getting heavy. my money's worth here. This is, this is money's worth. I think this is two or a jumper. Uh, uh, judging by my overall weighing skills. Is this one thing? Am I going to drop it? It's... This is an unbelievable box, like fair play to the sellers. This is brand new, so Adidas have brought oh, out wow. a range of like retro style goalkeeper shirts, like some iconic goalkeeper shirts. You've got a Mexico one, there's an Argentina. You but could you... wear that as a hat, that's like a beanie. Yeah. Um, Let me hold it. Uh, I'm going to be in this quicker than you can say Mexico, and I'm now in it. Oh, this is... This is great. I love it when brands like throw back to classic stuff, and this is definitely a great example. It's a bit big on me, um, but there will be a point where I put on the pounds. So I like how they've put in their little Adidas stripe down here. It's not too noticeable. Little centre piece here, centre logo. Um, beautiful. Wow! Beautiful! I think this has just been a very good, very good box. Very, very good. good, good. <laughs> you, had, you had me at the Maltesers. Yeah. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> this one is a shirt and I can believe I can see a name on there. I might be wrong. It is. You can see a name on there. France! It's a France Vieira shirt. What is going on with this box? This is yeah. unbelievable. Jesus. Like, in terms of money spent so far, like, we're not even... I think we're about halfway through. And we could argue we'd be at a £500 already. Like... A Patrick Vieira printed front shirt. Oh, this is what a box! Like what? What a box! Like a box. What a player he was. What a shirt this is. What a box this is. What a channel this is. Subscribe to the channel. So, is obviously other than that, are these all fairly old? Yes. They're very good condition. Yes. And they don't stink. So it's a ten out of ten from me. Oh, yeah, for me. I know who this is. It's England. No, I think it's Argentina. Okay, it is Argentina. With Savi Javier Saviola! <laughs> Javier Saviola. But what, this is a, I can't stress how much it's I'm loving this. Quality. This is. Oh, a little bit of armpit breathability. <laughs> We're approaching best mystery box of all time standards here. This is just unbelievable. I love that. I know I keep saying it, I know I keep praising it, and like, this is sponsored by Displate, check them out, but the sellers who have provided the box, like, You've, you've, you've excelled yourself. Like, I just, unbelievable. I really like that. Javier Saviola, like one of like, he's a cult hero, like a really good striker back in the day. Um, just very, 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 I'm very, very, very good. I'm impressed of how good my knowledge has been so far. You saw blue and white stripes and said Argentina. Said Arge no, and I got France, and I got Holland, and I got Brazil. Yes. So actually, so we've got five items left. Still, five, six, still. Seven. Well, I think we're definitely at a five hundred pound in value already, and we've still got five items to go. I'm doing great because I haven't spent anything, and I've got all these shirts. It's good for you, isn't it? <laughs> good for you. Just so. Um, oh, it's a new one. It's a Santa outfit. England. England. <laughs> what is going on here? What? Like, wait a sec, like. I thought you meant it was spelt wrong. Oh, right, so you hold that one. Show it to him. Is this... Oh, it's long sleeve. Yeah, so you hold that one. Let oh, me... This smells so good. And let me show them this one. What is going on? Like, what is going on? This is our Italian 90 home shirt. Like, is what this... is... 
Is this a David Beckham era? Yes. Shirt? Knowledge. This is. See, I know. Oh my God, this is, I'm telling you, best mystery box of all time territory is being entered very, 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 very quickly. This is unbelievable. Like. It smells so nice. We're, we're five items from the end. There's been mystery boxes where this would be by far and away the best item. Like, what is going on? Is this, what is going on? This is the reversible one. Go ahead and reverse it for everyone. They drop down, flip it and reverse See, it. See, I know my stuff. Let me work it. So technically, you just got three shirts. Technically. Um, is this is a jumper. Okay, I'm closing my eyes. Let me tell you what, what vibes I'm getting from it. Germany. Okay. Imagine if it actually is Germany. Imagine. It's France again. Oh, is that my eyes close? Yeah, but you can see it. It's two items open. in one again. I think it's three. Britain? No. Yeah. Well. I think we need a third person now. What is going on? Wow. I believe this is France's 2011, I'm sure. I might be wrong. I don't know why I'm talking like this. <sighs> this is my least favourite so far. Why? Because from the front, it's excellent. It's lovely. From the back, looks like you've either got a bodysuit on or a thong. Actually, the front is the same, actually. That, that bit there, it looks a bit like you've got a big wedgie. In the same package as them two, you've got... Hey, Papa! Hey, Papa! Very, very good. Like, I don't actually have many Mbappe shirts. This is the second Mbappe shirt I now have. This has been just... I, I, I'm not meaning to be so... Like, just, what, what is going on? What is going on? Like, if you want to charm me as sellers, this is how you do it. If you want me to be complimentary about me, you as sellers, this is how you do it. You've got me, all right? Well done. You've charmed me. You've charmed me. Club America. No. Just America. Just Club America. America is a World Cup. It's not just America. It's America. Just America. Oh, yeah. Sorry to all our Americans. You'll be my American boy. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, that's a really nice one. That's a proper shirt. This is a proper shirt as well. You've got a Japan long sleever in there too. Wow. Very, which one do you prefer in the Japan? This one. Or the US? I think this suits me. Yeah? I like it. Do you? Yeah. Yeah, why? I don't know, I like the stripes. I don't know, you sound like Kermit. I don't know, Miss but Piggy. I, I really like the stripes. I got the moves. This leaves us with two to go. Um, and the thing is with these two... Oh, they say things on them. This one says match worn. Yeah. And this one says match worn. Wait, does this one have a question? This one has a question mark and that doesn't. This was the bottom one though, so I presume this one might be the better one. I'm assuming that was the one Sorry. that set the box off because that was at the very bottom and it's it's been written differently. I reckon that is the best one. Okay. And we'll this keep... is the second Can best. I just appreciate by the way right now as well, like... How have we got two items? Two items left, they could be anything, right? And they'd be fine. But the fact there's two match worn items in there. Mm. Unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> Unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> what, hang on, you, what vibes are you getting from it? Well, by touching it. Just hover over it. Ghana. Ghana. I'm not looking. So it's from the Euros. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> what vibes are you getting now? Well, I, I, I don't know. What do you mean it's from the Euros? Well, it's got that on the... Hang on, it's got that on the arm. Ooh. It's Belgium. Courtois! I knew I was getting German vibes. Is that German? Belgium. You just said I... it's Belgian. Yeah. And they come... I thought that was in Germany. You've just taken away from a lovely moment there. Is that there. not in Germany? Well, Belgium. Belgium is in Belgium. <laughs> anyway... Well, it's like France, Belgium, No, just Germany, hang on. This is it? unbelievable. A Belgian... At least, at very least, match... Hang on a minute. Don't sniff it. How are we supposed to know? Is at least match issued Thibaut Courtois, Belgian sir, against Portugal German. from Euro 2020. That is... What is going on? I told you I, <coughs> I was getting Sorry. vibes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Alice, I've just been smoking 40 a day. I was getting vibes from that area. 
Told you. What is going on? Like, I am in love with what is going on. It's quite a big shirt. Yes, he's a tall man. He's a goalkeeper. How tall? Do you reckon Courtois is? I reckon he's a bit taller than you. So I reckon if you look at the camera. A bit taller than me. If you look at the camera, I reckon your shoulders are there. I reckon his shoulders would be here. Well, I'm six foot dead on. And I reckon his head would then start here, as it would. Sam, can we have a, um, a diagram as to how tall compared to me, Thibaut Courtois is? I'm if six I do foot. like a... I'm six foot. Courtois is what? Come on, we're taking away from what is going on as well. Like, this is just, I know I keep saying it. Just is un... he from the Euros? Yes. I told you, because I said about that. I also said it's Euro 2020 about 15 times yeah, as well. Yeah, but I said it first. OK. Should I tell you the colours? No. no. Can, do you know the year? Okay, so same team. Well, Belgian already. Is it? Why have you spoiled it like that? How's that spoiled? You were meant to guess whose shirt it was. Yeah, but no, because anyway, it's this is so boring. Is, well, you can't. No, that's not. I wasn't expecting you to go same team. I was supposed to guess the country. It's a World Cup box, not a player box. Yeah, but well, I don't know. Yeah, but new, but a Jan Vertonghen. Match worn Belgian shirt from the Nations League. The, what is going on? Like, of a tong we've got of a Tongan, we've got a Courtois, as well as all the other amazing shirts as well. Like, this is incredible. As if you needed any more shirts anyway. Want to get out? Yes. Um, I, I can't speak highly enough of how well this box This I genuinely think. It's even got a little pluck on it. Who, who do you reckon did that? Who do you reckon did that? The pluck. Yeah, do you reckon that was a little... No, you take the penalty. No, you take the penalty. No, you take the penalty. No, I don't think that was what happened at all. I think it was. I think if you watch the games back, that is what happened. I can't, I can't stress enough, like, this is, I think, the best mystery box we've ever done. I think. What about you? I agree. But Everything just... smelt nice. There were Maltesers. I knew most of the clubs and the countries that they were from. Um... <laughs> there was no clubs. They are all just countries. Yeah, but it's still a club. You know what I mean? It's a team. Yes. Will you just stop? Effort put in. Like they knew the style of how the video would work. They so did. They did a box. Do, like, the... Did up a box for me. Packaged everything individually. Sent us Maltesers. Sent us just honestly, just huge shout out to you. Check them out. Their Twitter's in the description. But for now, um, something we also need to address is what my plans are for the 2022 World Cup. There's been a lot of questions asked of me as to what I'm doing for the 2022 World Cup, and I feel like now is the time, a couple of days before it, to address it. I feel like the club season going on, the World Cup being in the winter is mental. The World Cup being where it is is mental, mm -hmm. um, but ultimately, I don't think that decision falls on fans, players, or managers. I think the reason it is where it is is because of several reasons, several wrong reasons, and reasons that are way above my pay grade to even understand. However, this is my job. This is how I make a living. So, and I, I make a living by covering football matches. So, I am going to be going out to the World Cup. To be very transparent and very clear, I'm taking no money from the World Cup itself. I'm not taking any money from the state of Qatar. Anytime an email or a conversation like that has been floated my way, the answer has been straight out no. I don't believe morally for me that's the correct decision to make to take money from because everything that's happened and everything was the way we're here is mental. I'm going off my own back. I'll have my regular away day set up, the regular sponsor on away days. I'm just going to carry on throughout the major tournament as I did with Euro 2020. I'm aware there's people that aren't going to be watching the World Cup. You don't have to watch or support my content during it either. I'm going out there, staying in a hotel by myself, traveling to matches, going back to the hotel. You're not going to see videos from me saying how lovely the place is. You're not going to see videos from me talking about the architecture. You're not going to see videos of me saying, oh, this is a great place to come and stay. I'm purely going out there for the football. I'm going to and from the matches. I'm going to make content and I'm working flat out for a month straight to make the best amount of content I can during the competition. I'm there for every England game until we're knocked out and then I come home. That is what is happening for the World Cup for me. It's been a really difficult decision to make on my end, but ultimately, like, this is my job. I think I saw Laura Woods tweet about it the other day and she was saying, look, if I didn't go, other people are going to go. Like, every ticket for this competition has sold and my job and my career would be in absolute tatters if I didn't attend this. I'm aware of everything against the World Cup and I'm completely against it as well, but I don't feel like that decision is on us as fans to take that decision. I'm going there to watch and hopefully see my country win a World Cup, um, even though I can already establish from now that I feel like that is already tainted a bit if we win it. Like, 
if we're to win it, it doesn't feel, it already feel, makes you feel a bit uncomfortable. Um, we'll see when the tournament comes around what the reaction to everything is. I think it's like I'm leaving you for a month. You are. And then coming home. But, well, it's not a month. It'll be however long we're in the competition for. It could be a week. It could be three weeks. It could be a month. It could be two weeks. Um, but that's what I'm doing. I felt like I'm always pretty open and honest on this channel. You're not going to see me conveniently have a, oh, if this happens, I'll fly to wherever and you'll, oh, no, they've sponsored it now. Like, that's not going to happen. Like, I'm never going to take money from the state of Qatar. This isn't a slight on people that have done. Um, like, that's their decision to make and it's their moral compass it will align with but it doesn't align with mine um, i'm going out there for away days um and also just a very quick one as well like my dream has always been to go to a world cup like it's been a life goal of mine since we met mm -hmm. a life goal of mine has been go to to go to a world cup um and this might be the only one i get to ever attend like in four years time there's a very real chance that you will have all moved on to other creators and away days won't be a thing i'm aware of that that's the security and the responsibility that falls on my job so this is just what I'm going to do. Um, and yeah, I, I probably didn't even have to make a video explaining myself about it, but I wanted to because I'm always pretty open with everything that happens mm -hmm. on this channel. And I feel like that's why you guys respect me. You might not respect this decision, but I feel like that, that was what I needed to do. But anyway, the mystery box was lovely. And the Maltesers, Mis I will enjoy them. Thank you. Maltesers were lovely. Um, the Panini stickers are lovely. I'm going to open them as soon as this ends. And the postcard thing. The postcard, the Royal, the, the Rovers. Fridge. Put it on the fridge. Bye, I've been Ellis. This has been Jody. I've been Jody. As always, I'm amazing. Well, thank you very much for watching. Be sure to subscribe for more away days and more football shirt content. And I'll see you very soon for more content for the 2022 World Cup. Or if you're not going to watch that, I'll see you after it. But anyway, I'll see you very soon. Ciao, ciao. Bye. <laughs>